What's up, YouTube? This your girl, Lofty Leah, and I'm back with another video, and I'm back in fully fat. As you guys see by the title, we have some more CJ So Cool and Royalty in the reaction, bro. So today we have, um, Royalty did make a video about, you feel me, the situation in Nike and her fighting like she glad that they fought and they can move on about their business but she did also mention in that video about what happened to cj so cool youtube channel that she can expose like she could she can expose of what happened like i don't know so we finna react to it we got the tea room it's called cj so cool truth exposing what really happened to the YouTube, you feel me? So we finna see what it's about. I don't know what world to mean. What happened to his channel? Like, what's going on? So we finna just see. Have anybody found the evidence of what royalty was talking about? Cause I wanna know. Royalty trying to take CJ YouTube channel down. She said delete. Uh, what she say? Delete all the videos with her kids in it, bro. <laughs> Crazy. But before I get started like this video if you guys enjoy my reaction comment down below what you want me to react to when i get straight to it but let's go ahead and see what it's about bro hey it's been getting crazy it's been getting spicy let's see what the tea room got for us eat my celery so Get your vegetables in. So in Royalty's recent video, she did speak on the whole fight between herself and Nike. Now okay. in this video, she stated that this was long overdue. And now Very. that this finally happened, she's hoping that they can come to a common ground and just quit speaking on each other. Now she did put most of the blame on CJ. She stated... Right, she sure did put most of the blame on CJ because CJ started this whole situation. He stirred the pot up. He ain't even try to stop it. He just keep mixing it up, mixing it up. He, I guess CJ loves seeing this. He likes it. That most of these problems that they're having is all because of him. So she pretty much went off on him and she's ready to expose the real issues that CJ is having. If I was you, CJ, I would tread real lightly because I know what the real issue is. And it all has to do with your YouTube channel. <laughs> Look at the mom in the back. So let's be for real. I know what's real. Mama look at the at the camera like Rosa going on. Mama had to look at the camera. Really up. You're putting everybody's life in danger. And you don't even see that because you want money and because you want views. I know what's up with your YouTube channel. I know what you did last year. What did he do I last know what year? You did. Spill it, Rosa. <laughs> So now a lot of people are wondering what is the issue that CJ is having with his YouTube channel. Now CJ has stated previously that his views are dropping. Now CJ did state previously that the reason that his views were low was because of YouTube changing his channel from entertainment to an artist. And all my videos was doing good until I became this artist channel. So once we can get that figured out, y'all will see. Recommendations gonna be better. My YouTube views can go back up, and then y'all gonna be like, "Oh, he wasn't lying." So now I don't believe that is what Royalty is speaking of. She's not now, speaking a lot of people that. assume it's that else. since Royalty and the kids left, people were no longer interested in CJ's channel. And although that may be one of the reasons that CJ may be upset because he's losing views because the kids are no longer on his channel. Royalty stated she knows what he did last year. So what? actually happened to cj's youtube channel what last happened? year but we're still fresh into 2023 so when royalty stated last year maybe she's talking about 2021 when cj sold future royalties of his youtube channel what youtuber cj so cool is auctioning 35 percent of his future royalties for at least 850 thousand 
market where music artists can offer shares of future royalties in exchange for immediate funding from investors has opened its business to YouTube creators. Wait. Oh, to an investor. So as you can see here in this article published in 2021, YouTuber CJ So Cool is auctioning 35% of his future royalties for at least $850,000. So this company, Royal Exchange, is a marketplace where music artists can offer shares of their future royalties in exchange for immediate funding from investors. Now in 2021, it opened its business to YouTube creators. So I'm wow. going to briefly read through this article, but it states prankster CJ So Cool, who has 8.7 million subscribers and an average of 30 million views per month is asking an investor to contribute a minimum of $850,000 cash to fund his video production efforts. In return, CJ will give up 35% of his monthly YouTube earnings, a cap of $55,000 every, every month, month until his funder has been paid out $1.1 million. $1 Just to put this in simple terms, CJ borrowed $850,000 from an investor right. and he will pay that investor 35% of his monthly YouTube earnings. Like, that's what artists do. Same way that artists do, bro. When they get signed, they get in. Let me close this window because you feel me? Dang, so they do that to YouTubers, bro. They give YouTubers money to fund their production and then they got to pay that back? Until he pays that investor back $1.1 million. million. In return, the investor would make $260,000. Now, in this article, it states that CJ earned a total of $490,000 over the past 12 months. Mind you, this is in 2021. He stated, what I love about Royalty Exchange is I can still collect a good piece of my monthly revenue while they're giving me a huge upfront investment I can use to create even bigger and better content. CJ So Cool said in a statement, these types of deals haven't been available to YouTubers before. But wow. if this is what Royalty is speaking on, I can see why this would be a concern for CJ. Now, obviously, he did state his views drop. He's not making the same amount that he was making in 2021. This would make perfect sense as to why CJ wants money and views because more views he gotta equals pay these more people. money. And of course, if this is the case, then obviously he would need more views and more money. I mean, 35% is a large chunk of That's your so monthly big. earnings. And it does seem like this was actually closed out. So CJ actually did receive the money and it even shows you who the investor was as well. Now, I didn't include it. Hyundai Sonata versus Toyota Camry. Put any of that in this video, but you guys let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. Could this have been what royalty was speaking on with yeah. what is going on with CJ's YouTube channel? Now there's also this guy on TikTok claiming to be one of the intruders during CJ So Cool's home invasion. Not claiming to be an intruder. Why? Why would you want to do that? Which is all cap, cap. but you can see here he He's has 200,000 views. views on one of his videos. Obviously, this Cloud is all for Cloud, but I don't think <laughs> it's a good idea for you to be claiming to be a shooter it's in stupid, an open, though. active investigation. How smart could that be? I mean, if the police are actually still looking for the suspects, wouldn't that make you a suspect, even though people know that you're lying because you're stating that you did do it? Right. And could you get in trouble for actually lying and wasting the police time? You know, be because jail. they may just actually have to go investigate this guy. Not very smart. It's not worth it. But anyways, you guys let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. I'm going to post his story here. I mean, obviously, he just listened to CJ's story and pretty much stated everything, everything that CJ, CJ said. said. <laughs> so, me and my homie, 
we got to drop on his location and stuff. We got to drop on his location. I think it was Lexi. She gave us his location. <laughs> so I'm worried. Not, not motherfucking putting on Lexi. She, he alone in the house. It's three o'clock in the morning. We just, just got dropped. She now just texting us saying she she gonna send us Addy. We got Addy. We came through the garage. Door. Lexi don't even know you. Uh, uh, well, Lexi don't know you. We came through the garage though. We broke in for the night. We put flashlights on. This wasn't this what we weren't trying to kill him. We were just trying to scare him. We were trying to scare him. So, bro, I'm not finna watch this because he's just saying what CJ said, bro. Like, come on, bro. Like, what you do when you broke in there? Like, did you go to other rooms besides going up the slide? No, nah, no. Nah, he's just saying everything was CJ. CJ said he ain't getting no other detail. But there you have it, YouTube, bro. That was um. Hey, tell me y'all, tell me what you guys think in the comments, bro. Next reaction on the way. Be on the lookout. I will catch you in my next video. Until then, hey, peace.